right, this is what we've all been waiting for here. Among many great finals, you have another one right here, the 1,000 meters on, not here, obviously injured, and you don't see the big name there that everyone here is looking at, and that's Apollo Anton Ono, poised for his first gold medal. If he can take on and take out some excellent competition in the form of guys like Charles Hamelin from Canada, Lee from Korea, Lee Ho Suk, his teammate. I mean, this one also, we've been saying it throughout the second session, this one is stacked in the crowd, ready to see what Ono can do. Yeah, you're right. And this race may be the most stacked, the most difficult race that we've seen today. You didn't see Apollo Anton Ono's name on that overall list because this is only his second World right. Cup of the season. So he, doesn't, he hasn't accumulated enough points to be on there, but I guarantee you, had he skated every World Cup in this year, his name would be right at the yeah, top of that a, list. He had a fall last week in Quebec. He was disqualified in another race, picked up a bronze in the first session here. And that's the guy many of these 3,000 fans came to see, and this is his chance, his opportunity. He's been looking to make a statement here and tell people he's back and ready for the World Cup champion for the yeah the world championships next month in Korea and, and he'll see that man there too yes he will and he saw that man at the Olympics Lee Ho Suk silver medal thousand meter at this Olympics Apollo Ono bronze medal thousand meter at the Olympics in Golden Torino State. so we've got the silver and bronze medal skaters in this Olympics Charles Hamlin as we've seen likes to skate from the front let's see what type of strategies he deploys here this is as good as any Olympic matchup we'd see, isn't it? Absolutely. Every bit as good as Olympic matchup. And a, oh, no. Oh, Hamelin with some problems stays up, though, and jumping to the front is Lee Seung Hoon. Hamelin right behind, and Ono oh, eyeing his opportunity. And He's here, fourth now. And here comes Lee Ho Suk to the front. Nice move, but a smart move by Hamelin to get in the second place to try to split the Koreans. You don't want to see him together, and here, here comes Ono. Oh, even with a little slip, Ono takes it all the way to the front. Effortless. A place he likes to be, Hamlin in fourth place. You don't see that too often. Lots of passing here as Lee Ho Suk gets into second place right behind Ono. Hamlin's in back. I look to Hamlin to try to get to the front here soon. He does not like to be in the oh, back. Oh, there's a problem. Oh, got a crash. And two down. And Hamlin runs right into Lee Ho Suk, who fell down. Now we got a match sprint between Apollo and Anton Ono. And Lee Sung Hoo from Korea. We've seen a lot of match races today. Apollo looking up and down, takes a look. There's a little bit of a touch. We'll see what happens there. There's going to be a lot of decisions for the officials. Apollo goes way right. The, the, the referees could call a cross track on that. Let's see what they do. I don't know if they will. But two Apollo laps. doing everything he can to keep it behind him. Less than two now. Pouring it on. The gold medal at stake here in Salt Lake City in the final short track World Cup event. It's everything we asked. Great race by Apollo Anton Ono. Played defense. And he wanted it, this one. Did it at a pure match sprint like you see in cycling. He was only racing Lee. And he out outsmarted him, out tacted him. Great race by Apollo Anton Ono to take the gold medal. Now the question is, as the crowd got what they wanted, a great day of racing. And that man, apparently the winner, did you see anything, Andy, that could take it away? I'd be surprised if they make any calls, but when you see skaters swing way wide and way inside, that's technically a cross track. Doesn't mean they're going to call it. I'd be surprised if they call it. We'll see what ends up happening. But a very good move here is by Apollo Ono. Making his move here and doing it wide. Look how strong he comes out of that turn. Goes blasting down the straightaway. Has a little bit of a slip right there. Still keeps his momentum going and powers all the way to the front of the race, which is exactly what you want to do in a situation like that. And from that point on, he's controlling it. Here comes the fall. We'll see what happens. And you see Leho Suck just gets back on his skates. Nowhere for Hamlin to go. As it goes right, they both go right into the boards. And here comes the and little see bit Apollo of a push off. No problem there. And Ono's just swinging his arm, kids him in the face. No problem at all. Okay. Apollo Anton Ono is golden again here in Salt Lake City. And the reason Apollo Anton Ono won that race is because he, 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 he made it run just like a match sprint in cycling, absolutely brilliant skating. And there it is, Apollo Anton Ono with his first breakthrough into gold of this World Cup season in great shape going into the World Championships next month. Plenty more coming up from Salt Lake City, but we'll end on that note as Apollo gets congratulations all around.